just perfect. Like, okay. He, he's and he's so big that you can literally grab him like free all the time. He touch he'll touch the the blizzard each time. He'll get touched by the the ice blocks each time. Like it's just yeah. really rough. You have to. You have to be aware of the fact that your back air and stuff stops the ice block, of course. And then you have yeah. to be just outranged. The same with down tilt. Yeah. Down tilt is an easy counter to that, in my opinion, because yep. it has long and range, it's fast. Yep. The rest of the game is just staying away when, when neutral with your range. Because yeah. you do outrange ICs. But once again, like, Ganon's, Ganon's fair is really fast, DK's fair is really slow. Right. You'll get punished super hard if you miss. As Ganon misses, he'll push him back like he's fine. So what's the secret tool to uh, neutral against Ice Climbers with DK? If any. If any? I think... Because uh, I obviously can't say the... that I know the fucking neutral very well with Ice I'll Climbers. I'll say you wait for Ice Climbers to jump, and you just immediately rush underneath them. And yeah. either, either catch him with a dash attack as he's falling, or you catch him with an up air. And then down B is also. Well, really I mean, good. obviously, anti is going to be really good. Down B is really good too. Down B, yeah. He'll he'll get away, but Nana won't. And once Nana's dead, like it's a one v one matchup. It's easy. Yeah. But even then, like uh, Sopo will chain grab uh, DK to help. When when Nana dies, it's like a whole weight off your shoulders. Like, yeah. No. It's like yes, I can be free. <laughs> I don't have to worry about grabs. You kind of do actually, but. Not, not as bad. Popo can still get really good stuff off of grabs, but it's already... Griffin's already putting the business in right now. Yeah. Overcommitted to the down B, but it was not punished. Yeah. I don't think Kojo's going to like this one. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, I... As long as he loses this match, I, I kind of see a Marth counterfeit coming in. But even then, you know, yeah. Does Kojo really know how to counterplay against ice climbers? I don't believe many people do. We don't have a lot of ice climbers. Well, recently we do. We have Dank and um, and Griffin. Yeah. You know, but this is recent. Otherwise, Colorado doesn't have. A lot of experience against the ice climbers. I typed it in once and now it's stuck there. <laughs> it goes oh. right into the grab. Yeah. Oh, but, and he also has charge punch, and that's like the other thing that you can do against Icy. Straight up neutral, just punch him. Like no recovery there. He's just kind of not too sure why. Yeah. Uh. -oh. But down he's able to the... wiggle out of the grab though, and had himself in an advantageous position. But I think he overcommitted with his yeah. neutral B. Oh, uh, he's gotten separated. But they're back together. Oh no, separated again. Now he's gonna get. He realizes the fact that Nana's down or side B lasts. A little bit longer, and he can just down smash or forward smash or whatever out of it. Sorry about it. So he really played with the timing there of that oh, blue side view, right? Yeah, yeah. The the, the side B is like his huge mix-up tool that he uses right. to really like mess up the opponent. Right, because you know he'll do a lot of the time um, forward throw. And then he'll re-grab out of that. But then four throw side B so you DI See, wrong. Like. Yeah, exactly. Because you know you have to smash the eye out of that four throw. Yeah. But if you do that, and in then the he side B's the, yeah. like you get caught again. Yeah. And then if you DI up, he'll up smash you to kill and you. And also just like a really hard combo weight too. I've noticed. Yeah, DK. Say per uh, perfect weight, perfect size. No, um, or ice see. climbers uh, four. You know, really anybody, like, he wasn't able to get his up throw, up air, on or anything like that right there. Yeah. Same. Like, really all you can do is, like, you want to get a fair as DK because that's the only, like, true combo tool. Yeah, and I, I, I like how, uh, 
Griffin, you know, really knows when to just reset to neutral. You know, yep. like he had him at the ledge. Bojo grabbed the ledge. He was already at the middle of the stage. Yeah, walked away. Like, let's just play said, again. Let's play again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm not going to commit to anything right now. That's actually, you know. That's what you should be doing. Like, because mm-hmm. it's not like being at the being at the edge with ICs is the worst thing you can do. Like, yep. it's actually pretty good, but. That's why he's at where he's at, which is top four of the tournament. I mean, it's only 15 people, but there's some pretty good players here. So. Yeah, Steel, Arcana, just me, you. Like, so Arcana's out. Who took him out? Uh, I believe it was Kojo. Because they played and okay. losers. So. Did he play as Charizard? I don't know exactly. Uh, oh, yeah. One ice. Or, or do you want to be expert 20x? What's that? Do you want to be expert 20x or porno? Porno is fine. Okay. Uh, Green Hill Zone. Yeah, like I said, like, straight up neutral B, like, in neutral, is really good. Because it has so much range that even if you mess it up, it's not going to punish you at all. Like, and that's the one thing you have to do with against Icy, not let yourself be punished ever. Because it's one punish equals death. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Griffin was uh, explaining to us, you know, the terror of neutral B of the icicles when you're off stage and yeah. I, I see it now especially again against yeah, Donkey Kong you'll get gimped he like already you know if he's hugging the ledge just on like green hill zone for example one, dunk you just easy carry him across stage put him down like like I said you get punished once you, you die is he smashed the eye the he, four throws um those those he didn't but uh, no smash exactly so yeah. that's something you gotta start doing yeah but yeah, the at second, the very the least, but even when you do that, it's still pretty you hard. You have to guess. Because like, Griffin knows, you know, he knows you're going to do that, and then he'll just be like, okay, okay let's play B, the neutral like, again. Like, <laughs> <laughs> or side B, let me continue, because you messed up, you died out. Ooh, right. There it is. And the roll doesn't no, fair. Committed to the fair a little too early there. Oh, okay. Take you know, time. against Icy's side B, you really can't, you can totally just wait and... Wait. Especially how high he recovered there. Yeah. Alright. That was See, smart. Just up air, get out of there. Like, yeah. Wait for the jump, and then you get underneath them, you hit them, you run away. Okay, get up attack. Throws some down B's, yep. and down he's in a really, really good. good spot right now because of that. Yep. Uh, and. Yeah. Nope, didn't get gimped. But now he'll die. I, I saw a down smash coming, but it didn't quite happen. Yeah. But he's gonna kill Nana? Nope. Knock them at each other. Oh, uh, they shouldn't have committed to the forward air there at all. Yep. That was good. There's fine, yeah, that's a cross yeah. up forward air, and that, that's a little different. Oh, that, was, that was so close. If Nana got that grab, it would have been over. And see, that's scary too, because. Okay, he gets the grab. Right under the platform there, and he has CI behind them. So I see you, Kojo. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Okay, goes down. All with right, the so straight up, that was straight up one v one. Straight up one v one. Oh no! See, see? exactly. It's right on that stage, especially, it's uh, pretty. Yep. Is he? Is he? Like he was off just enough. Or just, just like, any situation where like DK is hugging against the ledge a little bit. You know, that's he's a big target. He can't. He doesn't he, have that much mobility. He has no with, vertical. Like yeah. Nor that much mobility horizontally either. You know, like he get he gets he gets a, a nice distance though. Like he goes. As in like you can't really like you can't, B like, go to the right and then come back. Like it's it's yeah, really yeah. hard to dodge. You know, because he's such a big target. You can't just dodge away from that glacier. And yeah, then, yeah. You know, it's a that's a tough enemy right there. I can name a thousand different characters that have a better recovery against Ice Climbers than DK. Yeah. So yeah, so he is counterpicking the mark. 
which is a much, much better matchup. But Griff's, Griff's played this a million times, so it, it comes down to how good is yep. Kojo's mark. Ooh, he went out there trying to finish that off. Kojo made it back on. No DI, so he gets the forward smash. And uh, it misses the ledge trap. Fades back away from the forward smash, but that cost him a song. Yeah. Oh, Uppy. He couldn't go out. It would have killed him. Right. Would it have, though? He could have. He faded back, yeah, probably. But then again, like, you throw Nana, who knows what she's going to do, like. Oh, fair combos. Nana gets put out. Okay. I'm actually really surprised because he definitely overcommitted with his down B there. Yeah. But uh, he was able to get out of it because he just threw out a Randy down smash. Yeah. But he actually was very vulnerable right there. And probably could have lost the sock because of it. There's combo. Oh, let's go. Let's go, baby. Oh, he DI'd out. Smart. Good in there. Tipper. Oh, that would have been a punish. behind him again. I, I'm, I'm taking some notes on that one for sure. Because but a bad thing is if you do that, he can uh, side you in place and that will catch you too. Yeah. Like, you might see it, you might not. But like, ooh, even now, like it's looking good. He got Nana off stage. He's got... Uh, he has Soap on the ropes. Sword smash. Uh, I, w I would have loved to see an up air there. Yeah. Up air would have just put him in a very, you know, keep him in the air, but not at center of the stage like you just saw there. Good shit. Those dodges. Oh, I want to see up smash. <laughs> Making him. Too, too laggy. Not even the Tibber, just forward smash him, punish his lag. Oh, I can see him going FD. <laughs> He's like, FD? Yeah, against favor Ice Climbers? Favorable for Mark, but also very favorable for Ice Climbers. With no platforms run away, nothing but like just. Yeah. Pure. I, I believe in the. Flat, uh, flat land. I was gonna say away. I was gonna say I totally I very much believe in like Ice Climbers kind of dominating FD in a yeah. lot of matchups. Wario Land. Yeah, I can see that. Charizard Warrior Land. I'm calling it right now. <laughs> That'd be like, what, one forward tilt at zero and you die? Found of Dreams? Okay. Yeah. Mark, Mark does love the stage, but this is one of Griff's favorite stages. Ballsy enough to grab an ice camera. <laughs> I'm certainly not. <laughs> I never go for grabs. Oh, against. there it is. Uh, platforms. There it is. Oh, good, good. Save 
try and they, but mash out. Good, good mash. Yep. I wonder if he's doing that on purpose where he's making sure the, the last hit of the side B is the one that connects, because it does pop you up, like. And what what might look like a crappy pop up is like so good. Is <laughs> power shield at the first one? I believe in Ike versus Ice Climbers. <laughs> yeah, it's a good match. Honestly. You just get chain grabbed to death, like every other character. Yeah, I was gonna say that's, that's everybody. I just think I think Nair is a really good tool against them and against their shield. Yeah. Space far enough, you know, you don't get grabbed out of it. It's fast enough to Ooh, where. almost got that tipper. Yeah. Um. You talking about Nair on Ike? Uh, Nair with Ike against Ice Climbers. Okay. It's just like a, it's just a good tool. Same with Fair even. Yeah. Chain grabs with Icy, with Sopo. Oh, didn't get that. Could have been another really good grab. Oh, good punish. Outspacing a Marth with Icy is like, I'm, I'm proud. <laughs> Almost over, so. It's up two. Oh yeah, he's gonna that's his head. Pretty good, awesome. Yeah. I always was a good dude. Driven, driven's too good. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Net play warriors, dude. Never count them out. <laughs> Edgeguard a man. <laughs> uh, not in the air. Yeah, I, I noticed Griffin likes to do that anytime that uh, you're full hopping a lot. Because really, what else are you going to do to counter Glacier? Like, besides just like. Good match. Shielding or whatever. Yeah. But if you full hop too much, he literally just rolls behind your full hop and waits for you to land and then just grabs you there. So. He's looking for that one grab, like, because he's already at that kill percent. But. That's gonna be his advantage, just to make sure that grab never happens. Just grab ledge and that's it. Oh, maybe not. No! Can't believe you took that game. That's amazing. Try to get ledge, but Nana got Let's it go first. Kojo. Kojo is not dead yet. Nope. Yeah, that's two two. It's a uh, Griffin's bands. I like Kojo because he's a fighter. He's a fighter. He doesn't want to lose. He's here to win. He. He doesn't take any game too hard. He's, you know, he's he loses and he's ready for the next one. Yeah.
I'm just proud he made it past seven places in this tournament. That's very unlikely. Who, Griff? No, Kojo. Kojo. He usually gets seven? That's what he's known for, man. He's the seven plays master. Oh. <laughs> he holds that seven plays down. But right now, he's, he's saying fuck all that. I think I got ninth <laughs> this time. Something like that. Ninth? Yeah, something like that. I feel like Kojo gave you his seventh. Oh, yeah. I did get Kojo seven. He's passed the curse to me. No. <laughs> now I'm looking to take top five of salty ones. So I think I think, there, I think there are a few key matchups that I can win. I just have to get kind of lucky with bracket. Yeah. It's like Junebug's not the only good game. That's this weekend, huh? Yep. Wow. We leave. Friday at like 1 p.m. Yeah, dude. I don't, Drive I'm there, not, get drunk. I'm not going to any tournaments this weekend, but I'm going to watch Salty One for the big house. I wish I had my TV like this week. Yeah. Week. Well, we have, uh, time to have it. we have HDMI cables now, so. Oh, yeah, we have that one TV. Yeah, and uh, I got an HDMI cable at the dollar store, or the good, Goodwill. So, it should work. Sweet. Taunt. Disrespect. <laughs> Sick! I love that. Threw away Nana because you know he's already high percent. Next hit was gonna kill anyways. Ooh. Ooh. I want to see that double dare. Yeah, that's what I was looking for too. Uh -oh. That's just bullshit. Like, no, but I mean, he did, he did an SDI out of any of those, which was yeah. He really has to focus on. There that. it is, two. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll be out of it. Yeah. But Griffin will find a way to counter any escape that you can come up with. That was a really good double near two, and then just kind of reset it from there. Yeah. One neutral again. That's safe. That's cool. That he lets Nana grab ledge so yeah. that he doesn't have to put himself at risk. And you can command Nana at ledge. Winner of this fight, Steel. Yep. Which really both are going to be interesting. Yeah. I think um, Steel might switch for the IC's matchup. Possibly. To uh, Meta Knight? Yeah. Why Meta Knight? Uh, I think for fast down smash, fast nair, like stuff that will keep playing. Even if he, even if he messes up, and he, like he'll still kind of keep himself safe. Because you know, Popo shields, Nana doesn't shield nearly as fast. That's it. Yeah, I know I can't play my main against Ice Pass. No. <laughs> Brute force. Brute force only. Not quite gonna happen. Dude. You sit back down if you take a break, yeah. <laughs> oh, see you later, Code Joe. Yeah, have a safe drive, man. Good stuff. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for kicking my ass. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's late. Yeah, you'll get you'll get there by midnight. Yeah, you'll get there by midnight. Or whatever.